am currently battling COVID-19. While I was away in New York City, I found out that everyone in the house had COVID and they were at the end of their, you know, COVID experience. And I was seeing my future, you know, what it would look like for me. And I was, I felt I had that sinking sensation. Oh, great. That's what I'm going to have to go through. I found out this new product. It's this Japanese um, marinade. And I put it on everything now. It's really freaking good. Demand seems to be growing. Um, at least in our house, my mom bought like five. I'm going to play this game. This game is a... Um, we're gonna we're doing a sim dating dim sim, dating sim later game. What? Dating sim game. This is a um, a date with death <laughs> on new grounds. There's something better than going on a date with the Grim Reaper with death when you are currently battling COVID nineteen. One time in New York City, I definitely saw someone who was like, <laughs> and they were with their partner. And their partner was wearing a mask. And then they started making out. <laughs> I was just like, what's the point of the mask? <laughs> so anyway, we're going on a date with... It looks like it's not responding. Oh no, there's necrophilia in this game. Not into that. It's called Element Date. And it works. Okay, we're definitely going to have to play this now. Uh, the date and the time is all correct. Good job, folks. Jack Evans, 26. Ain't no tempest. This my pretty mask can't handle. What's up with the two hearts on the bottom? What does that mean? Does he get lives? I'm looking for someone who likes to party all night out there. I'm not into that. Sorry, Jack. Alice de la Fontaine, 24. Just out of pilgrimage station, looking for a deep spiritual connection. It would be like dating someone who kind of looks like me, so. Oh, whoa. I'm four light years away. That's pretty far. Whoa. Vincent Cassidy. He's like in Shanghai or something. 42. I deduce a crime's gonna happen tonight, and I'd like to be your alibi. Why is he a secret agent? Huge fan of justice. <laughs> Currently working through some stuff pertaining to my admirable ex-partner and my despicable ex-partner. So two different exes. It's kind of one of those situations where you have to like weigh it. Okay, he used to be a cop, but then also used to be a thief. So there's balance in that. I like the honesty a lot. That's cool. I do like big cities as well. You know I like my whiskey and chocolate. I, that's that's how you end a night. That whiskey and chocolate. Man, that last part really is sticky. It's sticky stuff. I'm going to say no. Sorry, buddy. Star kill. No age. Identified. Galaxy renowned mystic assassin. Okay. A lot can happen when the lights go out. Tell me about it. <laughs> Death Cab for Cuties, I Will Follow You Into the Dark. It's actually Death Cab's lowest charting single. Recorded with just a single microphone and very little editing. Before he turned 30, Ben Gibbard was thinking a lot about death. To the point where he wrote a song about it. It's, it's just the idea that what if somebody dies and we're just floating, just stumbling around in infinite darkness and I'm just trying to find some kind of spiritual kind of peace with myself in the world. Behind me? That's creepy. No, that's an, that's an assassin. That's a healer. <laughs> Sl I'm slow, guys. I got COVID brain. The historian. My legendary sword and I can show you the most ancient bonding rituals. Oh, can you? I like reading the Bible and taking <laughs> walks on the ruins of my enemy's former land. Let me give you a history lesson you shall not forget. If we end up together, expect to fight a lot. That is how you know we're doing it right. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> 
Arthur Sebastian on Darrow, 63. I work hard and play harder. You know who he looks like. Yeah, he looks like the Terminator. I'm okay with that. I see everyone so far has been so messy and he's at least he's at least just working out, I guess. He's not he's got a metal arm like what he's a robot. That's why he's a robot. <laughs> Zero. Yeah. Speaking of computer robot, thirty one. Swipe left if you don't like dating women that are smarter than you. Ha 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 ha. Look. You know how this goes. You're interested or not. I'm entirely dedicated to my work, but relaxing every once in a while helps me focus later. Try your luck now. Before I like her because that's that kind of how I think. You. I'd run. I want to go. I'd want to go to. I wouldn't want to go. I don't know. You'd have to take a chance with someone that that you like. In terms of the way that their values are, the principles, right? She she's pretty. I don't know. Yeah, give you a heart. Thank you. Oh, wow. It's a match. Cool. Uh, it's too quick. It's too soon. It's too soon. I'm still healing. I'm still I'm still healing from COVID. What keeps sw- swiping? Can I revisit people I've... to every obstacle that has ever come my way. I'm sure I'll adapt to you just fine. I'm great with the little ones, especially with my target. That's funny. He's from uh, Firefly. Why am I an obstacle? He's already painting me in an o- as an obstacle. Okay, cool. So I guess I'm gonna go on a date with Maria. You find yourself in a sketchy alley in the Mentasa district of the CSAC, thinking this is Maria Gal must have given you the wrong address. When a small iron door opens, just like in the that, dark and she peeks out from it, nodding for you to come inside. You sure. follow her through the lab into her bedroom and she starts to unbutton her lab coat. Wait, here. Dude. Let me put on something a little more. She doesn't know. Contaminated. An elegant wooden piece of furniture draws your attention as you wait. What? Eventually, curiosity overcomes you and you open the main drawer, revealing dozens of intricate, enticingly shaped instruments. Okay, Maria folks, I didn't realize this, this was going to get like at. this. Don't worry. I wasn't planning on using those on you. Wait, are you interested? Oh my god, this is this is this is going way too fast. I have COVID. And she's telling me that she needs to put on something a little more not contaminated, but I am riddled with germs. I don't know. I'm not ready for this. I wasn't ready for this. Yeah, I didn't really want that. Sorry. Oh, I was just curious, you say. They look like they're a little too much for me tonight. It's okay, Maria says reassuringly. There's no shame in being curious. She gently closes a drawer as she what? comes to embrace you. Is there something else that you might be curious about? You know what? I think there is. You answer, tracing with your fingers a network of twisting patterns on her skin that a less scandalous outfit would no doubt hide. What are these? They start to glow ever so slightly under your touch. She says, um, just watch them do their thing for now. Maybe later. I'll and I'm really confused. But I guess that's what dating's about. You're kind of just led from one thing to the next. And it's all very confusing. Um, until it becomes clear. I hope you liked watching me um, just be surprised by how forward and curious the whole experience was um i love indie games so much because what just happened 